Good day and welcome back to another DBZ Doka Metal video. So in this video I thought I would just cover very briefly what you should be focusing on right now on DBZ Doka Metal Global. Obviously we have a tiny bit of downtime before the Saiyan Day begins, uh, it's usually on the 18th of March and we should be getting some news about it soon. So I thought let's quickly cover what you should be doing, what can you do, what should you focus on and yeah. So obviously just remember your support memories, uh, there have been some new ones added like in the fight against despair uh, and it drops from stage 9 and it's a Vegeta's family support memory so that makes it pretty valuable and pretty useful for a lot of content. Then if we want to focus on some events uh, obviously you know just to clarify you kind of want to start with the extreme Z areas. Uh, I'll leave a link in the top right hand corner about how to prepare for prime battle trunks etc. But you want to start with the fight against the spare extreme z area uh, that's for the android 17 and 18 that obviously dropped from the same story event they'll be used in this extreme z area for the protector of future trunks this is probably the biggest thing that people need to focus on right now if you haven't done it very powerful free to play unit that's good against multiple enemies i've done a review on him which you can gladly find on this channel Next, of course, uh, is if you are focusing on the trunks, uh, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go and do the Super Android 13 event. You have to complete this event and farm the Androids 14 and 15 from it, so you can use or do their Extreme Z area as well. They drop from stage one, and the strength Android 13 you find will be able to be purchased from the Bubba Shop for Incredible Gems. You will find links to videos that you need up in the top right hand corner displayed throughout this video to hopefully help you out. Then once you've done all of that you should be able to tackle the Extreme Z area for the Super Android 13 and once you've completed this you should be able to take on the Trunks event. As you can see there's a very small list of units that you can utilize, Prime Battle Vegeta being one of them. So you need to be a bit careful about which Prime Battles you need and which you should farm. Talking about Prime Battles, there's obviously a couple that are up right now. Uh, you're going to need to focus on First Form Cell uh, if you want to do Trunks' Prime Battle area or Extreme Z area, I should say. And of course, you're going to need to focus on the Trunks himself. Uh, links to how you farm Prime Battles will also be up in the top right hand corner. So once you've kind of finished with the Trunks Extreme Z area, maybe you are done with that. Maybe you need something else to focus on. Uh, so in terms of events, there's nothing too, um, I would say, urgent, barring the Trunks related events. Uh, you can obviously do things like the, um, you know, this Universe's Strongest Warrior challenge. Uh, there is a nice support memory here, so if you haven't got the support memory from here, it's very, very useful. Uh, it is a extreme class support memory, so that's why I suggest picking it up. It's a very simple one. Uh, extreme class uh, team is buffed by 10% for two turns against super class enemies. Very helpful for ESBR, um, for LGE events, legendary Vegeta events, all those sort of things. The rest of the events you can kind of tackle as you want to. There's no real specific need to focus on any of them and none of them really drop currency per se that you can use for Elder Kai's. Uh, the only one I highlight is this Time Traveling Warrior Strike mission uh, because Trunks can currently be used for the Super Android 13 Extreme Z area. You may want to focus on this one and just farm up this unit and get this free to play unit ready as it will be a big help for that. In terms of Z battles there's not too many that are currently up. The Extreme Z battle for the LR Physical Trunks is one that you can focus on. And there are still the Fusion ones up in case you want to tackle those. Along with a couple others that are always kind of up. So it's not really a big deal. I would say the Trunks one is your biggest focus. And then finally uh, there's been a new Infinite Dragon Ball History stage. I have done both category challenges for this stage. They are currently up on my channel if you want to go take a look at them. You can, uh, some nice stones there as well, as always with the infinite Dragon Ball history. So I would suggest that you focus on it. Then of course you can always link level uh, if you need help with auto link leveling. I will see if I have space to fit the link up here, but it is area seven, stage 10. 
and then of course uh, if you are looking for something else to do maybe uh, maybe you are just trying to take on some challenges uh, I would say your next best bet is going to be uh, finishing some of the LG EGT challenges that's what I'm going to be trying to do uh, just finishing off a couple more of them filming them and putting them on the channel uh, you can focus on the gods of destruction events you can fill out some of the other extreme z areas there was a new stage added into super battle road as well uh, that you can focus on the siblings bond stage so you can clear that as well remember if you ever need help with what you want to focus on or do giru's guide will show you where you can farm super attacks uh, it will show you which units you can awaken which free to play units you can farm and it's a very helpful tool if you're ever wondering what to do besides link leveling so yeah that is pretty much it. I just thought I'd give you guys a little bit of help, a little bit of maybe an inspiration or maybe a little bit of a spark on what you can currently do. We should get some news within the next day or two uh, that will give us a little bit more information and a bit more hype around what we can actually focus on uh, and what will be coming to DBZ Dokkan Battle Global. Uh, so I don't expect uh, there to be too much downtime uh, but obviously saying day is technically only on the 18th so you might have one or two more days where you can just focus on whatever you want but as always guys that's going to be it from me so take care leave a like if you enjoyed the video or leave a comment down below if you need any help but as always i'll see you guys in the next video so until then take care and bye